Hello, citizens of Netherlands, and welcome to the Frontiers. We are playing Paradox Mini Mega Dutch Campaign as the King of Netherlands. King of Aquitaine seems to be having some kind of an issue. Prince Eustache is claiming Aquitaine. Prince Eustache being who? Not sure, but. Hmm. I don't know. Somebody. We attack this host, and we kill him, and he lost. Good. Finally, the host war ends. We can finally hold the grand tournament and go on a pilgrimage. Hold the grand tournament. Hold the feast. I oh, cannot hold a feast. Okay, that's fine. Let's visit uh, the tomb of St. James, because that's what our dynasty usually visits. We already visit visited the other two, so pretty much. That's pretty much it. There's a jihad for Persia. Excuse me. There's a little bit of. What's going on here? Who's the. Who's the jihad target? Hang on a second. Are you taking. He's attacking Il Khanate. There is a Sunni jihad for Persia. Just pretty much. If he wins that, he's gonna get a hold on the. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 whole counties. Oh my god. I'm scared. Il Khanate is scared. Can you see Il Khanate being scared? Well, actually, it's not even that. If Il Khanate loses this, he's gonna lose his vent spawn, spawn troops. That's not gonna be good for anybody. I wanna be paranoid! Ah, bloody hell. Duke Demis, the young, blah blah blah. Greece wants to. Oh my god! Count Walter claim. King Reginald Nether Italy claim. Uh, Duke Roloff of Courland claim. And just Dutch claim on Greece. It's pretty much the King of Dutch Lithuania against the world. <laughs> Funny. And also sad because the same thing happened to Karlings. They were just fighting against against each other for titles. Well, I kind of understand them because there's nobody else to kind of attack. But anyway, <clears throat> we can get a chance to either get one point in learning and intrigue. This is a higher chance of getting anything than this, so I'm gonna go and do that. Ah, uh, we didn't get anything. Okay. A small war, do I? A small war. A small fucking war. Are you real? We have a lot of heresy in Nevers. Let's go and proselytize them. We should not let the heretics take over. Um, there is some cult of arms I couldn't even respond to. What happened, Queenie? What's going on, Queenie? Peasant revolt. You want me to help you with the peasant revolt? I don't really get it. I don't really get it. The truce. Are you the peasant leader? <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> oh, the irony. He signed the truce against the Duke of Sevilla. Duke of Sevilla being who? Oh, this guy. Well. Apparently he couldn't put down a peasant revolt. It's, that's funny. Catalan Catholic peasant leader. Doesn't really actually mean I'm gonna help out with these wars, to be honest. I guess there's nothing else to do. Let's go and kick some butt. We'll start with this army because it's trying to win. It's almost winning the war, so we're gonna help out with that. How's our technology looking like? We are two points before actually being able to level up. Italian claim in Burgundy. That is actually a war I want to help with. Because I want to lose Burgundy. That would suck. Do 
Guess what, Italy? Burgundy has strong allies. Do you have strong allies? I don't think so. Despot of Croatia and King of England. Pfft. So what? Do we still control Scotland? Scotland? Yes, we do. Our attractive cousin controls it. That's pretty funny. <clears throat> Intrigue, prisoners, ransom people. Our heads will roll. Whatever. There we go. Ransom people. Oh no, Ross is very mad. I probably should do something about that. But I don't want to. Because that's stupid. Why would you do anything? Just sit down and relax. It's got 20,000 men. I'm surprised. Nah, uh, we're fine. He's fighting in the river crossing. Yeah, we're, we're easy. Easy. We just squandered his entire army. Can we not declare war on you? Probably not. <coughs> and now we have to siege. <coughs> Which is Burgundy doing pretty nicely. Thank you, Burgundy. That's kind of nice, actually. Not losing the title, you know. kind of helps. Just keeps hiring mercenaries, apparently. That's not smart, you know. Ada was born. I don't care. I don't care about women. I'm gonna completely occupy one county, and then I'll leave. Apparently, England is helping out him. Okay, maybe then I'll, I'll find England a little bit. Just a tad bit. <coughs> Just a tad bit of fighting England. Nice. There you go. That was enough to bring him to 100%. For her, in that case. There's still a Byzantine peasant revolt, but I think she's fine. to revoke. Peasant revolt. Yeah, he would You're fine with that. Why? You, he didn't even need my help there. That's funny. There's this war. She... Lit Litgallian League Independence War. No, that's not it. War against the Tyranny. Hmm, interesting. What? Did he just lose all his dukes? Duke vassals? Not sure what happened there, but... Alas. This Duke Demes the Young, he needs to fucking die. <coughs> He's got a strong claim inheritable by a successor. Uh huh? He's gonna cause problems for a long for a long ass time. <sighs> a tithe? Good. Let's put up the speed five, just so you know. Stuff happens faster. Time of armies around faster. Time ticks. Strangers from beyond the sea. Holy balls. This just sent the chills down my spine. <sighs> Alright, guys. The fun time's over. Fun time's over. We are now facing a real threat. We are able to raise around 70k. With the help of holy orders, we would be able to raise like another five to ten thousand. 
and then there's allies to help me out. Uh, we should be fine, but you can never be sure. You can never be sure. Also Denmark, why are you so dumb? Dumb dumb! No, what's this? Revolt? Or, no. Is, what's this revolt? <laughs> <coughs> He's me he's messed up. A letter has arrived from the Holy Father. He demands that we release Prince Bishop Leon from prison and submit to the will of God. Sure. Sounds fine. It's probably a jerk anyway. It's hard being friends with someone more ambitious than yourself. It is for my own good. Please let me Ah oh, god. That sucks. Didn't get ambitious. Basel inheritance, Count Gerald of Friesland. Seems fine to me. What kind of. What's wrong with this inheritance? I don't know. Get back all the lands claimed in this war. Might not actually be able to afford continuing this this fight. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure I want to let Demes win. At this rate, why didn't you just get rid of him? Okay, he white pieced the most dangerous war. Maybe because the you know the Duke of. The King of Sicily, or Nether Italy in this case, isn't somebody to fuck with, to fuck around with. Alright, you! You, sir, are royally screwed. Why these armies are just standing around... Oh no, there they are, okay. I thought he, I thought he disbanded them for a second. He's fine up here. He is completely fine. There's grease up here as well, lol. Walter's claim of Greece ended in a white piece, okay. Somehow he inherited this duchy. Nether Italy inherits this duchy, of course. Because why not? And Lithuania inherits this duchy. Nice. Just fucking <laughs> make a mess. Make more of a mess that up there. I am completely okay. As long as you roll Reginars. Reginar. We're fine. Looks like the em uh, the Empire actually took advantage and retaken some land back from Greece. That sucks. At this rate, Empire might actually be able to, you know, hold its own. This is a huge fucking dude. No, I mean, not to count. <clears throat> he owns a lot. A son was born. Mark, mark him. He's ill. Might know it not gonna live for long, but you know, keep him marked anyway. Keep him marked. Successful jihad. So now the Arabs gained. Yep, whole five counties. Behold! Let's check out the ledger for the sea. What's the largest army in the world? Army. I should be ready for the Aztecs. Arabian Empire fields the largest army. Then there's me. As in Lugia, El Canate has like nothing. So apparently, Ar Arabs completely slaughtered the t the El Canates, and the Mongol hold. Mongol holds shoot on each other. So yeah, they're pretty much not important at this point. Unfortunately, Aztecs aren't be are gonna be as easy. Still Catholics. You didn't convert, lol. You suck at conversions. You suck at conversions, you idiot. Fool. Yeah, it's fine with all those wars. I mean, come on, there's a 14,000 stack running around. Yeah, I didn't see any large, large 
forces. So yeah. Don't see any problem up here. Don't need to come up there. Do I? I'm just waiting for the for the Aztecs. Aztecs, please. Just waiting for the Aztecs. Oh, wait, maybe, you know what? This game is getting a little bit boring. I think maybe as soon as Aztecs arrive and then the Timurids arrive, we might just end the game right there. Oh, you know, we'll see. Maybe, like, look at this, the King of Aquitaine changed. Who's new? Oh my god. It's not Gavelkind. That sucks. Can we kill your wife? No. Alright, are there any women in line? Robert Hugue. Hugue, no. There are no women to inherit. That sucks. This Duke is pretty strong. Apparently the King of Aquitaine cannot take on the Duke of Aquitaine. And now there's two Aquitaines. The Tale of Two Aquitaines. Duke Siviard is the second. Siviard the second. Probably one of the revolters, is he? No! Apparently he's not. Where is the Duke Siviard? There he is. Not of our dynasty. I think we should help out the boy. Why are you not asking me to help, boy? idiot. Oh, I was pregnant. Yay! Game of Thrones. Let our enemies tremble. I guess this gives us something to do while we're waiting for the ad sticks. England, England's just right there. Beyond the channel. You can go and help. <coughs> Charge, my Dutchmen! Take back these holdings. Smash the rebels apart! Apparently, this war just started because people are still joining it. Still has 4,000 men, that's cool. That means he will actually have any troops left at left after I finish off the armies. Fuck me. Sunset invasion. Thousands of exotic ships have arrived in Gulf of the Cadiz, spewing out numberless hordes of illuminating Ill warriors in weird armor sporting feathers and bone. These invaders from beyond the sunset worship hellish demon gods, sacrificing the populations of entire towns and altars erected on top of pyramid shaped wooden edifices. They cut their victims' hearts out carefully flay them and let their devil priests wear the skins for many days. Why the fuck are you important? I just spawned two characters out of nowhere. This boy, this guy and this guy. Hutla Twani Oli of Jesus have mercy. So let's lower the speed. Um, I think speed 4 is fine for now. And we will have to help out with this invasion. Because, you know, <coughs> it's an invasion, goddammit. While we do that, let's raise our men, let's raise our boats, let's raise our holy orders, all of them. Let's uh, put the men on the boats. Let's... Why are these men are not on the boats? This is the Duchy of Burgundy. Okay, well... Screw that boat shit then. Put the Irish at least. Get all the boats to Burgundy. Get all the men to Burgundy. 
Can Burgoyne hold it? No, it cannot. So I guess we're gonna have to get like these guys up to Brugge instead. <coughs> now, you get to Boulogne. Or actually, yeah, let's go get to, get to Boulogne. These ships get to Boulogne. Actually, I don't think we need you. Yeah, we're gonna be fine without them. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. <coughs> don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. I'll see you again next time where we're gonna be fighting the Aztec Empire invasion. He has quite a lot of troops, but guess what? We also have quite a lot of troops. See you next time. Have a good day.